Paul here with Tim. Hi Tim, how are you going? Very well Paul. Hi Noel West, good to see you again. Well, we had another great Sunday on uh, just, just past where we were looking at the book of Job and uh, Tim opened up uh, Job, a big chunk of Job for us and it was a great Sunday. But also last Sunday we had some interesting news from our beloved Tim and Lauren, which is hard for them at the moment I think because when you look how beautiful it is today, they're giving this up uh, to take the gospel to where a place where they'll probably get this three times a year. That's right. So we heard some great news about you guys down in Scotland uh, to take the gospel to Glasgow or part right. of Glasgow. Can you tell us a bit more about what's, what, what's happening to you guys? Yeah, so we are off to Scotland start of next year oh, in January. Right. Thank you, thank you. You got my prop, my prop man. Uh, we're, off to, we're off to Scotland the start of next year and very um, excited about that, also daunted. Um, but uh, yeah, in case you missed the announcement on Sunday, we are moving to Glasgow to join a church called St Silas, um, which is an Anglican church in Glasgow, and we'll be with them for 12 months as we build a launch team to plant a church into the east end of the city, which is an area of Glasgow where 0.3% of, of the population are in an evangelical church on a Sunday. So it's a, it's a really gospel poor part of um, the country and, uh, and yeah. the, the world. Wow, there's a lot to be done there. There is, there's, yeah. there's stacks to be done. But I, you know, it's really interesting for us as we've been over there and as we've talk, talked with people, there's, there's a fair bit of energy about the evangelicals who are in Scotland at the moment. Um, because as, as Lauren shared a little bit about this on, um, on Sunday, but uh, there's a lot of churches that have gone through the, the painful process of leaving mainline denominations. Uh, but it means that they're not spending the energy on, you know, fighting the political battles within churches anymore and so they're freed up to focus on you know, being on the front foot for the gospel and, and sharing the message of the Lord Jesus with uh, you know, those in their communities and so there's a good sense of unity, you've got um, Anglicans and Baptists and Presbyterians working together, like-minded uh, on key convictions and yeah. um, seeking to reach out for others so we're really excited to, to join that work and um, yeah, praying that God will, God, God will use us. So if people wanted to follow you and pray for you, how can they, how can they do that? Yeah, so we're going to have a link going out this week for um, an opportunity to sign up to our prayer newsletter. Uh, so we would love uh, our Norwest family to be supporting us in prayer. Uh, and if you uh, sign up there, then you'll get, um, yeah, you'll, you'll hear our updates as we go. Fantastic. Norwest, this is such an exciting part of um, our partnership with the Lord Jesus in the gospel and with Tim and Lauren as they go to Scotland. So be praying for them. Uh, it's kind of sad that by next year they won't be with us, but at the same time, we, uh, we rejoice with them and we also support them as they go out to spread the gospel. Thanks, Tim, for sharing some more. Thanks, Paul. Here's our outro music. <laughs> Uh, that's the finish.